In Delaware, uh, we're very uh, interested in making sure that all three of our counties are represented. So it's an important piece of the seven-member panel to make sure that we had representation from each county, because each county has something uniquely distinct to offer uh, a filmmaker and somebody coming in to shoot a film. Um, you know, it, Sussex has its own interest in unique places and, and the shore and, and the farming industry and Kent County has the same thing in its historic uh, structures in Newcastle County. I mean, we have a lot of interest. So you get a seven member panel, you ensure that you have one person representing uh, each county, you get somebody from the banking industry because they are involved with the loan process. They're involved, they're knowledgeable of what it takes to for the bank to be able to invest, because when the bank provides a loan, the bank is in fact investing in a project. So you have a banker. And then you, we're, what we're actually allowing is people with experience in the film industry. We want these people to be from outside of Delaware, uh, to have a input into our local system, what's worked in other states, what's worked in Hollywood, what it, does it take to have a successful movie be shot in your state. So we, we were allowing three of these members to have experience in the film industry from other states. And we're, we actually set it up in the regulations that these committees, that the committee can meet telephonically. So we're not going to have to pay the members their transportation costs for coming into Delaware. We'll allow telephonic meetings to discuss these issues. We want people with knowledge, and we want people with local knowledge as well. So knowledge of the film industry, knowledge of our local Delaware uniqueness to be all a part of this process and they'll all be appointed by the governor. And we have a, a, a structure set up right now in the draft bill that I hope is going to make it to the final bill. That is a requirement to fund a film. It has to be made by uh, what's called a supermajority or three-fifths. In this case, f uh, five out of the seven members. Um, if they submit this proposal and for some reason the our director of economic development thinks it's an awful idea, he, he or she just doesn't like it, they can veto that funding. Well, if the seven-member panel really feels strongly, then they can override that veto by a unanimous vote because that way we will make sure that there's a process check in, in place and we'll make sure that there is a true vetting of these projects through both the Film uh, Commission Office and our Office of Economic Development.